just take your own initiative and yeah. learning for yourself and, and, and doing your own research and maybe delving a bit further into, I don't know, like out with recommended reading lists and things like that and um, making your own, I suppose we're all independent learners, especially during COVID. I mean, you need to, I've had to make my own timetable basically and make sure I stick to it and things like that. Um, otherwise, I would just no work would get done. Do you know what I mean? I don't know. Yeah, I think independent learning is uh, has a lot to do with accountability. You need to be accountable uh, to yourself, and and it, it's I think it's got a lot to do with being honest with yourself as well, because like um, especially with with online learning. Uh, I don't know about uh, how everyone else is doing it, but with our classes, all you had to do was just log in, no video, no audio, unless you're asking a question or unless you're doing a discussion, we're not obliged to put video. So uh, I could just log in and go back to bed. So, but with accountability, it's um, also thinking about why you're doing what you're doing. Why am I in uni? Uh, why am I studying what I'm studying? What do I want to gain from it? So I, I always look at it as um, you get given a bag with um, 100 points and how many points you get from that bag is, uh, depends on you. So if you keep working hard and picking up more points, that's on you. You can get a 75 at the end of the semester. But if you, uh, get, if, if you only uh, pick 40, you get a 40, you pass. You know, I don't know what a pass is in other unis. You pass still, but it depends on how much work you actually put in. So I've, 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 I always try and remind myself where I'm coming from, uh, why I started, what, I, uh, why I started, why I decided to go back to school, and uh, what I'm trying to gain from it. So that always tries to 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 bring me back and and keep me working as hard as I can. So for me, that's independent learning. Also, another thing is you don't, if I don't do the recommended reading, nothing happens to me. No one is going to say, oh, you didn't do the reading, so you're not getting funding this semester. Everything is still the same, but it's it's all up to you really. If, if um, you do the recommended reading, you'll get better marks and you'll be a better social worker or you'll, you'll be a better historian or whatever uh, course you're studying. So it's all up to you. So however much you put in is however much you get out. So that's independent learning for me. Yeah, I'd, I'd agree with that. I think it is all about kind of, the, kind of what the both are saying it would be the independent learning, like, if I don't get up and I don't, I've got a timetable as well that I follow. So if I don't get up and I don't follow that timetable and I don't do everything that needs to be done, then I'm not going to pass and I'm not going to progress. So in like that, the additional reading as well as recommended reading, I mean, we do that every week. Every week we've got a reading quota that we need to do. Um, and I do that every week. I make sure I make the time to do the reading make my preparations for class. It was, yeah, just doing that timetable, making sure that you were fitting everything in. Because if you're going into a class discussion about a certain topic, if you haven't done the reading, then you're not going to understand what it is people are talking about. Then when it comes to write the essay, you've not had that discussion with other people. So you've only got the academic reading in front of you that you need to then make sense of to write the essay, which again is a bit of a struggle. So it's taking the ownership that if you need to do this in order to progress, in order to understand what it is that's asked of you, no one else is going to fail for you. It's all up to you. Um, I always go into an essay looking at, look, a 40 is a pass. Just as long as we get a 40, we're fine. Um, but I think that gives me that wee boost to go, right, with, I think you've got a 40 here with what you've got. Let's see if we can add in a couple extra bits and boost that result a little bit.